What comes to mind when we mention young people, Irfan? When we mention our young people, for to me, uh, it comes to mind that they are our future, they are our hope. So we need to give them an equal opportunity to do good in their life. No matter if their parents didn't do well, but we need to tell them with these today's awareness that they can do better than their parents, than their brothers. So we need to encourage them. And we need to actually remove the barriers, uh, actually, that uh, uh, don't allow them to achieve the things they want to do. I will give you an example. If they want to actually live, uh, play football, they had to hire a ground. They had to pay for that. Then they had to get the health and safety thing. They had to pay for that. And so it's like all paying, 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 and paying. So it's better like if we make it very simple, allow them to do what they want to do, rather than getting a cheap cane of beer and drinking in a corner. Thank you. Young people, young people are amazing. Uh, we need to support young people as much as we can. Uh, we have to support them from our community, from the council, and families need to support the young people. Um, Young people are looked on at the moment, you know, in a very bad sight at the moment because of what's recently happened in Manchester with the riots. But um, what are the core issues for them, you know, going going down that way? Uh, university fees. University fees have gone up. Um, the, the extra support they need in college and schools and youth centres. A lot of funding has been cut in youth centres. And uh, I think it's a real shame at the moment, so we do really need to support you. Um, I think young people have got a bit of a slightly bad reputation because a lot of blame is put at their doorstep for um, antisocial behaviour, perhaps, and things like that. But in my opinion, young people are obviously our future generation, and the most important thing we can do for them is open their minds to all the possibilities that exist in the world. So support them in whatever they want to do through education or um, travelling or whatever, anything that they want to do with their lives, we should be supporting. How many issues uh, young people face? Uh, there are issues with education, there are issues with their parenting, there are issues with their future jobs. So there are so many issues. If we will start talking about the list, will go on and on and on. But the thing is, we have to start from the basic to give them the basic education, so to make them uh, base very strong. So for that, they had to actually we had to make it easier for them to go to the colleges and to go to the university, not, not to think about the money, not to think about that how them they can get the money. So let's try to actually make their future bright by giving them a good education. Island. Uh, what issues do young people face? Um, I think the issues young people face are um, access to education because stu student fees are going to be so high over the next few years that they're going to have difficulty in accessing further education. Obviously joblessness, so they might be forced to stay at home with their parents for longer than they wanted and not spread their wings and have an independent... Uh, young people face uh, many problems nowadays. Um, with the, the new government coming into place, uh, a lot of local councils have been forced to cut a lot of funding. A lot of youth centres have been closed down. A lot of sports centres have closed down. Um, there's not many opportunities out there for young people to just develop. So um, there is major issues because if there's nowhere for them to play, go, safe place, uh, they're going to be on the streets and on the streets they're, they're going to end up uh, hanging around people's houses, parks, the shops, and it just looks like a, a threatening um, sort of like atmosphere. So there'll be risk of them getting involved with crime, antisocial behaviour, and it's, it's serious issues.